It's a big night here on RTV6. Dancing with the Stars is back. And we're following IndyCar driver James Hinchcliffe very closely, hoping he can get into the next round. Dancing with the Stars is filmed in L.A. And tonight, RTV6's Day First is among those stars in Hollywood. Day, break it all down for us. What can we expect tonight? <laughs> Hi, Erica. Thanks. Welcome to uh, Hollywood, everybody. Big breaking news this morning. Before we talk about Dancing with the Stars, I mean, this thing shut down every newscast this morning in Los Angeles. It rained like, like a quarter of an inch, and it shut down the interstates. Big breaking news. I thought I'd just pass that along to you back in the Midwest. Oh, hi. Welcome back. It's great to be back on the set of Dancing with the Stars. They are rehearsing right now for the 8 o'clock show tonight on RTV6 and ABC. Uh, week 7 already. There's only like five weeks remaining, and so far so good for IndyCar driver James Hinchcliffe and Sharna Burgess. Let's flash back. Recall last week, week 6 here on the set, and the last time we left, both Hinch and Sharna, they were doing the rumba, which is a slower, more sensual dance, a lot of hip movements, not to mention a uh, see-through shirt and a spray tan for our hero, James Hinchcliffe. But they scored a 38 out of 40, received two tens a week ago, second highest score of the night, and obviously advanced to tonight's week seven. He and Sharna, I tell you, have consistently been in the top half of the scoring. Question is, will that continue tonight? Jitterbug. Yeah. Uh, you ready to go? Yeah. <laughs> hmm. um, Just say yes. Yeah. It's easier to say yes. Yes, yeah. let's go with that. Uh, what's this been like this week? For this, this week's been tough. It's um, for a couple reasons. The jitterbug, it's a very quick dance. There's a lot. Of, so anytime it's quick, it's a lot more choreography, right? Because right. you got to fit more stuff into the same amount of time. And so there's, there's more choreography, which is always tough. It's very fast. So trying to keep time is very difficult. And Jitterbug's like a kind of rough, dirty kind of style of dancing. It's 40s, 50s era, speakeasy, music goes on, you kind of just have at it. And it also opens the door for tricks. So, you know, lifts and throws and flips and right. things of that nature. And so when you start tossing people literally around the room, <laughs> it's, it's, it can be dangerous. Uh -huh. I'm a little beat up this week. <laughs> yeah, alert the medical staff here. We're going to see, see women flying through the air, namely Sharna Burgess. Anyway, should be a lot of fun tonight. We talked about the scoring. Look at Hinch in the first six weeks here. The Foxtrot, the Paso Doble, the Cha-Cha, all among the leaders in scoring. And then it was the Quick Step. He scored his first 10 a couple of weeks ago. Week 5, the International Tango had two 10s, that one. And then last week, of course, two, two, two 10s with the Rumba. As well. Hey, coming up at 7 o'clock, uh, we'll reveal something that Hinch wasn't sure he was supposed to reveal about next week's show. We'll talk about that again coming up with the news at 7 o'clock. And if you want to vote, I'm just saying, and he would appreciate the fact I'm passing this along, the number tonight, 800 868 3405. He would appreciate that. And as they say in Chicago politics, vote early and often. It's all about the Mirrored Ball Trophy. Great to be back in Hollywood. Back to you guys in Indiana. Very interested to hear what Hinch has to say.